Hi, I'm Emily LaRue, and right now we're going to talk about shoulder isolations. So again, we're going to start with our feet apart, toes facing forward, make sure you have a slight bend to your knees. Now what we're going to do is we're going to start popping our shoulders straight up for four counts. So we're going to stay stationary, keep your knees bent, we're going to pop them up, two, three, four. Now as you pop them up, I want you to bend with it. So we're going to go one, two, three, four. Now as we press down, you're going to drop your shoulders into the ground again, hitting the sharp pop. So again, we're going to drop it down, two, three, four. Now we're going to also add to the front. So you're going to concave your shoulders in, popping them in. Now you want to make sure that we're not opening our chest and getting the chest pop in here. You want to make sure it's just the shoulders stretching out here. So keeping your knees bent, we're going to press forward. We're going to go one, two, three, four. Then we're going to pop them back, opening your chest up. One, two, three, four. So let's put that all together. So here we go. And five, six, seven, eight. So we've got one, two, three, four. Down, six, seven, eight. Pop it forward, two, three, four, and back, six, seven, eight. Good job. Now I want to add our individual shoulders. So we're going to go right, left, right, left. You want to make sure you're picking your shoulders up to your ears. Because if you make it like this, it's going to be so small, no one's going to be able to see it. So we're going to start with the right. Try not to move too much of your body. We're going to go right, left, right, left. And as you can see, as I'm picking up one shoulder, I'm dropping the other one sharp. So you don't want to make it nice and easy. You want to make it sharp. Here we go. Ready? Let's take eight of them. Six, seven, eight. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Good job. And that will complete our shoulder isolations today.